Hi everybody and welcome to Knobcomers Days 2018 Day 2. My name is Liana and I am here with Dan Kaufman from FedEx. <laughs> Dan, please introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Deanna Kaufman and uh, I am in FedEx and uh, the group that I work with uh, is called Customer Solutions, which sounds exactly like what it is, is we are there to help our customers, um, you know, solve problems uh, that they might have and achieve the best results that they can uh, oh. with our solutions. Thank you so much. And uh, could you tell us about the speech you'll be de delivering today and why you chose that topic? Yeah, absolutely. So the speech I chose today is really is about global e-commerce. So I think something that uh, maybe a lot of people don't realize is, you know, when you think about how much e-commerce there is in the United States today, there's already over $420 billion in B2C e-commerce today. Um, I don't think what people realize is that the cross-border e-commerce will reach that amount in just a couple of years. So if a lot of um, companies out there are not um, transacting business globally, then they need to start. Yes, exactly. Yes, and uh, how do you think, uh, what main trends and challenges and changes perhaps in 2019 for e-commerce to expect? You know, I don't expect a lot of changes, um, but, but, but I think this is an important point to, to remember is that um, you know, a lot of retailers are trying to manage fast and free shipping mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and that changing dynamic, but they also have other opportunities because the reason e-commerce grew is because of convenience. And if you can't provide your shoppers control over mm -hmm. the process, especially that mm -hmm. shipping process, right. then they get frustrated and that eats right. up the convenience. Right. And then you have to work about, you know, about processes around returns. And so, right. you know, I think that um, retailers have a lot of other opportunities mm -hmm. to be focused. Mm -hmm. And uh, and then the last point I'd like to make about that is I think that um, a lot of retailers are so focused, especially domestically, mm -hmm. whatever country they're in, mm -hmm. but I know in the United States, especially hyper-focused on the United mm -hmm. States. Um, but I want to remind you that companies like Amazon are using mm -hmm. this time to really hone their practice overseas. So again, if people are not thinking about how they can transact business cross-border, it could be an opportunity and you could yield a lot of competitive advantage to Amazon. Right, right. And I'm sure that FedEx is prepared for that. Oh yes, absolutely. <laughs> Um, right now we're uh, we're a 65 billion dollar a year um, revenue company, uh -huh. uh, and we acquired TNT in Europe uh, and their ground network two years ago, and we're in the middle of integrating them. And what that does is it gives us a lot more power to support e-commerce and every other kind of transaction oh, uh, that you can think of for supply chain and logistics perfect. around the world. So we're <laughs> set, we're certainly here for our customers. Oh, thank you so much, and we are very very glad to have you here, and uh, we wish you and. FedEx all the best and my last question is what is your first impression about our now commerce conference you know it's been fantastic content um, it's and it's great to see how focused a lot of the audience is I mean they really are here to learn um, and be engaged and network with one another so it's great to come to con you know sometimes I go to conferences with thousands of people and speak at those and you know people are just kind of wandering around or they're there because of the location or something like that but the attendees here they really Really want to be here and they really want to learn something so oh, that, that's a that's a fantastic opportunity to get to thank address thank you thank you so so much and thank you for being here and we are appreciate that and very excited for your speech all thank right you great. So much. thank you so much thank you guys